In this video I want to show you how you can send your first program written flow code to uh, an all code buggy. So if we just first of all load flow code and select a new target and it's a 16-bit pick uh, the all code buggy and we select that as the target then we can write a very simple program. Now there's the device, it's a beast of a device. It's actually uh, hidden on the all code buggy underneath this uh, plastic plate. Uh, so you can't see it on the buggy itself. Um, and I happen to know that the LEDs at the front of the buggy are connected to um, port E. So we'll just put a bunch of LEDs onto port E on the PIC micro. Um, there's a bunch of LEDs. We'll connect them over here to um, port E, port E low. It's a 16-bit port. And we'll just write a simple program um, here. OK, so we'll output. Uh, actually, it's done that for us. It knows LED5 is on port E. We'll write a 1 to LED5. Um, we'll copy and paste that and say 0 to that pin. Then we'll have a delay of a second and a delay of a second and uh, an endless loop and we'll put those into the loop that's our program we'll simulate it um, so that pin there is flashing and then we simply um, we want to connect the buggy so we connect the usb lead and press the reset pin to put it into programming mode and then we go compile to target give it a name buggy one and it is now compiling to the device and now you can see the led on the buggy let's just enlarge that a bit it's um, the fifth LED is now flashing at one second intervals. So that's your first program. Um, next, what you need to do is you need to get hold of the um, data sheet and find out all the different connections to the buggy so you can then program the motors, the display and everything else. Thank you.